Spin up clones because today's edition covers the men's basketball team. All right, first off, I need to start off by giving a shout out to the women's basketball team for winning their home opener against Rampo College 75 to 54. Mallory George had an excellent performance, earning a double-double with 19 points. And I also need to give another shout-out to the Centenaries dance team, who had excellent performances at both the men's and women's basketball games. Great job, ladies. Now, moving on to the men's basketball team, who played on Saturday, November 14th. The Centenary Cyclones took on the SUNY Maritime Privateers in their home opener. And I gotta tell you, the game was full of excitement. To start the game off, Maritime won the tip-off and got to work early. Early in the first half, Maritime had a 15-point lead and was looking dominant with a score of 19-7. But a storm started to brew as number 2, Paul Jones, went up strong for a layup and added an and-one for a 3-point play that sparked a flame. The clones started to make back-to-back stops on a couple of steals. As the tempo shifted in favor of the clones, Maritime calls a timeout. Right after the timeout, Centenary's number 30, Jake Logue, makes a statement as he steals the ball and slams it home for the first points of his career. At this point, Centenary only trails 30-28 to with the tempo in their control. Before the first half ends, number 5, Rashawn Spencer, makes a layup and hits a step back to give the Clones a one-point lead. Centenary leads going into the second half, 36-35. to The Clones enter the second half with a chip on their shoulders, knowing they stormed back from a 15-point deficit. Maritime is about to go through the eye of the storm. Number 5, Rashawn Spencer, hits a big-time three in the opening seconds of the second half. However, Maritime slowly gains momentum back as they take the lead. But the lead doesn't stand for long, as number 5, Rashawn Spencer, would answer again with another big three, launching the Cyclones back into the lead, 45-44. Rashawn's three-pointer set the eye of the storm right on Maritime as the Cyclones would keep the lead the rest of the game. With 6.39 left to play, number two, Paul Jones, hits an amazing three-pointer delivering the dagger to Maritime. Centenary would go on to win 80-60, to and the two big players of the game were number five, Rashawn Spencer, who finished with 27 points, and number 11, Anthony Bailey, who came off the bench and had 20 points. Great job, boys. Well, that's all the time I have for you today, clones. I'm Chris Snow, and I'm signing off.